Francillon, by Alexander Dumas Fils is a poignant and thought-provoking novella that explores the complexities of love, morality, and the consequences of societal expectations. Set against the backdrop of 19th-century France, the narrative unfolds with an intricate blend of romance and tragedy, revealing the author's keen understanding of human nature. At its core, Francillon delves into the theme of societal norms and the pressure they exert on individuals. The protagonist, Francillon, is a young man torn between love and duty. His internal conflict is emblematic of the broader struggle faced by individuals in a society that often dictates the course of their lives. Dumas Fils masterfully captures the essence of this struggle, intertwining it with the nuances of human relationships. The novella opens with a portrayal of the quaint village of St. Martin, establishing the idyllic setting that belies the tumultuous events that will unfold. Francillon, the son of a respected family, is betrothed to Eugenie, a match arranged by their parents. However, the arrival of a mysterious stranger, Rosette, disrupts the equilibrium of Francillon's life. Rosette is an enigmatic and free-spirited woman, a stark contrast to the reserved and demure Eugenie. The love triangle that ensues serves as a vehicle for Dumas Fils to dissect the intricacies of romantic relationships. The author skillfully navigates the emotional terrain of his characters, portraying the conflicting desires and moral dilemmas they face. Francillon, caught between the societal expectations of his engagement to Eugenie and the magnetic pull of his feelings for Rosette, becomes a symbol of the struggle for individual agency in the face of societal constraints. As the narrative unfolds, Dumas Fils explores the consequences of societal expectations on both individuals and relationships. The clandestine affair between Francillon and Rosette unfolds against the backdrop of a society that frowns upon such deviations from established norms. The author underscores the hypocrisy and rigidity of societal expectations, highlighting the harsh judgment faced by those who dare to challenge the status quo. The character of Rosette is particularly intriguing, serving as a symbol of defiance against societal norms. Her autonomy and refusal to conform make her a compelling figure, challenging the conventional roles assigned to women in 19th-century society. Dumas Fils paints a nuanced portrait of Rosette, revealing her vulnerability and strength in equal measure. Through her character, the author invites readers to question the limitations imposed by society on individuals, especially women, and contemplate the price of rebellion. The narrative takes a tragic turn as the consequences of Francillon and Rosette's forbidden love become apparent. The inexorable collision between personal desires and societal expectations culminates in a heart-wrenching climax. Dumas Fils employs vivid and evocative language to convey the emotional intensity of the characters, creating a palpable sense of tragedy that lingers long after the final pages. In conclusion, Francillon, by Alexander Dumas Fils is a captivating exploration of love, morality, and societal expectations. Through a meticulously crafted narrative and rich character development, the author weaves a tale that transcends its 19th-century setting, resonating with universal themes of human nature. The novella's enduring relevance lies in its ability to prompt reflection on the timeless tension between individual desires and societal constraints.